I'm Lonita Cook, Better KC film critic and in Kansas City Magazine contributor. I have two films for you today. We're gonna to be talking about Maleficent, Empress of Evil, and Dolomite is my name. First up, Maleficent 2. Angelina Jolie and Elle Fanning return as Maleficent and her beastie for a tale of true love. This time, Aurora is getting married to Prince Philip and Maleficent has to defend her honor and her claim to motherhood. We will learn if Maleficent is still the hero and the villain, or if she is now just the villain. Returning with Joaquin Roning at the helm, Maleficent is a fable about the devastating and potent power of prejudice. Even though they try to refresh in the tale, it comes off silly in its characterization and pretty ridiculous in its narrative. If you found the first film likable but forgettable, you'll find this one somewhere in between unbearable and regrettable. All right, coming to Netflix October 25th is Dolomite Is My Name, starring titan of comedy Mr. Eddie Murphy and he is paying homage to Rudy Ray Moore, adored for his contribution to the black exploitation era of the 70s and to this brand of comedy that gave birth to comedians like Richard Pryor and Eddie Murphy himself. The best thing about this movie is its universal spirit of hope. Rudy Ray Moore was a washed up musician beyond a certain age who could have given up on potential and possibility, but he created this dynamic character, Dolomite, and he really just went for it. The worst thing about the movie is that it's so great that it deserves this wide, extended theatrical release, and it's not getting one. I'm Lonita Cook, and that's your new movie wrap-up.